What's up everyone? This is Max Red. Today we're going to make an 808 from scratch using Retrolog Synth inside of Cubase 11 Pro. After watching this video, you'll have yet another tool in your arsenal for making a nice clean sub bass associated with the 808 sound that's used in hip hop, trap, and EDM. So let's get started. First, we open up an instance of Retrolog in our rack. Once we create the track, we'll set the tempo at 140, which is the standard for traditional trap beats. Now we can get into our settings. On the top left, we set the voice to mono since we'll be creating a sub bass sound. We then select sine as our waveform. Next, we set the octave level to 8. In the amplifier section, we set the attack to about 35 milliseconds. This controls the amount of click you'll hear in your 808. From here, we can play with the different settings, such as the glide, decay, and the resonance. You can hear the glide effect better if you use your MIDI keyboard. For this track, we'll take off the glide. We can add harmonics and adjust our sound with the resonance and the distortion. Okay, now we're ready to lay out an A bar loop for our pattern. Okay, this is what we came up with. One way to make your 808 sound unique is to insert a plugin such as Max Bass, R Bass, or Low Air. We'll try Low Air on this one. Don't forget to EQ your 808. We'll use FabFilter Pro on this. Let's add some more elements to this track. Okay, let's listen to our sub and solo. We'll add the kick and other elements as we go. Okay, here's our beat. That's all I have for today. Subscribe if you like the video and leave a comment to see others like it. Thank you.